Hi, my name is Johnny Wu. Today I want to introduce my research paper named Economic Impact Analysis of China. This research paper may, um, pay, pays attention to analyze the modern economic situation in China to estimate wh whether this company can expand its business in China. Um, this research paper can be divided into two parts. One is benefits factors, another one is potential risk factors. Um, here's, the project, here's the project overview. Um, for the benefits factors, the first one I want to introduce the customer situation in China um, with fast economic development in China. Now people spend more money of their inco income to spend on the, the production where they can express their own personality better. Um, for the large, uh, for, for the labor, the second one I want to introduce the labor institution. Um, as everyone has, uh, as everyone know already, uh, the China has large labor resource due to the large population. Um, here I want to show two pictures about the labor institution. The first one is about the number of employers for several countries like China, United States, and France, and Japan um, for, se for, for several years like, um, from 2002 and 2009. Um, this bunch of numbers is obvious that's for China. The second picture is, uh, is average hourly costs of employees in China uh, from 2002 and 2009. Um, it's increasing during those years. Um, the last but not least is for the government policies. Um, since 2002, the Chi Chinese government joins into WTO organization. That means the government should open trade barriers to the world more. But sometimes uh, more chances means means more risk, and um, so the government policies can be another part another part of the p potential risk. Um, because the Chinese government should have restriction from, uh, uh, because the, the the Chinese government should have um, restriction for their native enterprise. Um, the, the, another potential risk is negotiation. Um, what is interest is that Chinese are formal and indirect when they express their own opinions. Um, for example, they should be titled. Uh, they should they sh they should be addressed with titles during the business. Uh, in conclusion, I think the company should avoid those potential risks. And at um, the same time, they should take good, they should take good ad ad advantage for the um, benefits factors to do better business in China. And um, that's all part about my presentation. Thank you very much.